This is Code Combat. I'm working on the challenge Sleep Hour. It's part of Introduction to Computer Science. Okay, it's one of those levels. Um, it is the Python version of this level. Challenge level goals. Escape to the red X mark. Collect all gems. Use at least one concept. Use, uh, use movement arguments. Defeat the ogres using strings. Ooh. Strings is what they're calling their name. That's a string. If you write it in a quote, that's a string. This is a combo challenge level. Complete the level goals and at least one of the concept goals using your programming skills you've learned so far. Basic command, movement arguments, and strings. Okay? If you can, complete all the goals. So, this is a combo challenge. You must complete the level goal using at least one concept you've learned. Yes, if you can complete all goals. Got it. A string is anything in quotes. So Ursa, right? If I did attack and put Ursa's name here, this is a string. And we know that because it has to be surrounded by quotes. A string is another word for a sentence or a word encoding, right? And it is kind of strange to say that, but it is. It's called a string because first there are characters, which are char, but characters. So it is a string of characters. Anyways, that's what it means. Use arguments. Well, we're using run with attack and Ursa is a string. Okay. So defeat the ogres using th strings. Well, we'll have to do that. It looks like we need three of them. Well, they have three names. And then use, oh, movement arguments. Okay. Um, and remember, anything that starts with a hashtag is a comment. These are for humans to read. The computer ignores them. This is a combo challenge level. Defeat ogres, collect gems, and escape to the red X. Use string and movement arguments. We're starting way up here. Nope, just kidding. That's not us. We're here. So I'm going to go ahead and walk down and all the way over, I guess. Let's give that a shot. Get rid of this. Down. Okay. And to the right. And I'm going to use the fancy way to do that is by putting a number here. So I don't have to say go to the right three times. Oh, I think I only need... I could also just leave this empty and type move to the right again. I find this way better. Down. Drop. Do I need to attack those things? I'm going to look at my hints. Basic commands. Yep. Don't walk over the piles of rubble. True names. Okay. I don't think I do need to attack those things. Weird. All right. And then I'm going to walk up and then attack. Okay. And I'm going to attack Ursa once. And I think Ursa will take two hits. So Ursa again. And let's see what this does. Boom. Excellent. And then we can't walk over rubble. So now I have to walk all the way over to here. Which is left. And again, instead of writing left again. Oops. Again, which I could do to go left twice. I can also just put a two here. Oh, and then I need to go up one. And to go up one, I can just leave this blank. And then I'm going to attack Rex bar. What? Argument, attack, argument. That's what, what is it doing? String, what's wrong with my, I don't, we're going up here. Why am I not hitting him? Oh, capital. If you don't do it exact, it doesn't work. And I think I'll need two hits anyways. Shut up. That looks good, I think. It's all running, and so then we're going to have to go two to the right. Oh, let's actually go to the right one, because then we got to attack, and then we're going to use Brock, which is the string, right? But that's their name, and that's, since it's in quotes, we know it's a string. Brock, and then I think we'll just need to go right one more. Let's see what this does.
Oh, I guess write two more. Great job! You completed all the goals! Yay! We did it! Excellent!